I'm Patty Fernandez and I'm an art teacher. Visit my website at pattyfernandezartist.com. Okay, let's draw. Today's project is how to draw a middle colony's colonial home. I take two fingers over here on the left and I put a dot. And from that dot I'm going to draw a slightly wavy line all the way over to the right. Okay? I come about one finger up at the top over towards the left and I put another dot. And from that dot, I'm going to draw a little straight line over. Come back to the left. Let's draw a straight line down on the left and a straight line down on the right. Come back to the left and we're going to draw a wavy straight diagonal line down. Wavy line down. Connect. Come on the right hand side, we're going to draw a wavy straight diagonal line down and a wavy line down connect. Come back to the very top, we're going to draw a straight diagonal out, straight line over, straight line connect. Come back to this corner at the top and let's just draw a straight line but leave it floating, okay? Come over to the left. Right here we're just going to draw another wavy, wavy line down, over, connect. Come on the right hand side and we're going to, right at the bottom, right here at this point, we're going to draw our straight line up. A little bit further up we're going to draw another slightly wavy line, diagonal out, in, connect. Come back up to this corner at the top we're going to draw a slightly wavy line out, down, over, and connect. Right about here we draw a wavy line out, wavy line diagonal out, wavy line in, connect. Come back inside on this part right here. We're just going to draw a wavy line down, connect. Come over here on this side slightly wavy line down, connect. Okay? Come back over here on the left. We're going to, starting on the edge, we're just going to draw a wavy, wavy line, connect. I know, it's a lot of wavy lines. Alright. Coming over on this section in the middle, wavy line down, connect. Come inside, wavy line over, up, wavy line up, connect. And on this side, wavy line out, down, connect. Okay? I think that's it. Alright, now come all the way down to the bottom part and we're just going to put some wavy lines. One, wavy line two, wavy line three. To fill in the background over here on the right, I'm going to draw slightly wavy line down, connect. The letter V jump over, slightly wavy line down, connect. Come back up to the top and just do wavy line, curve, line, connect, wavy line, curve, line, connect. Come over on the right hand side. If you have room, we're just going to do slightly wavy line, letter V, slightly wavy line, connect. Bring one up a little higher, slightly wavy line, down, the letter V, slightly wavy line, down, connect. If you have room, slightly wavy line, down, the letter V, slightly wavy line, down, connect. Now just come over and just do wavy, wavy line, wavy, wavy line, hello, wavy, 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 wavy line, connect. These are all overlaps, wavy, wavy. There's no right or wrong way to draw these. They're organic <coughs> trees. Okay, now, the last part is pretty intense. Um, starting on the left, we're going to do little skinny mini straight lines on different sections of this drawing. 
Take your time. This could make you crazy, but re just remember that the drawing part on this project is intense, but the coloring is really easy. Now I come to the center spot space and I draw skinny, skinny lines all the way down. Now this is the part that makes the middle colonies architecture or homes unique was that they used a lot of timber and these are all slats of wood kind of like a, a log cabin but this is finished this is a more finished look so you've got all of these skinny mini lines all the way across from house to barn to fence keep going and they're skinny, they're not fat like a log cabin would be. Okay, this is the door. Jump over, now you've got skinny minis over here. You want to try and keep them even so you draw them and then jump over, draw, jump over, draw, all the way down. <clears throat> keep going, keep going keep going. Now they even did, this is the barn, they even did this section also. Same way, skinny minis all the way down. And like I said, I know this is a tedious, but imagine if you had to build it. Keep going, keep going, all the way down. Okay. That's it. All right, let's see how we're going to color this in. Okay, like I said, the easy part is the coloring in part. So right here on this space, we're going to do some double color. And I'm doing straight lines going down and wavy lines on the sides. And that is yellow. And that is because these homes had thatched roofs which is made out of straw, which is very European, which is very much where the colonists came from. So first I'm going to do some yellow, then I'm just going to do some lines of brown. Wavy lines on the sides. They had some brown up here, but all of this is thatched roof, even here on this side. Then, since I have my brown out, I'm going to go ahead and do my tree trunks over here and these are stylized trees you can make any kind of tree you want this is the kind I made and then that's it on that now next color very important is black these are doorways so these need to be black this is black this is a window this is black and this is a doorway to the barn I think so this is black. So you know that's the entry point. Okay? Then take a gray if you have it. And you don't have to do every single straight line, skinny mini. You just need to put some color on here. So I'm just doing some straight lines going across my buildings. And also don't forget your fence and your bottom entryway. This was a road or a lane or something. Okay? Then green for your treetops all the way across. And if you want blue green for your sky. Now you can pretty much change everything about this except for the actual buildings. Okay? Alright, let's see what this looks like all colored in. Okay, here is my middle colonies home all colored in. And it's interesting because depending on what kind of materials you have in your neighborhood determines the way your houses look. Okay, bye-bye.